Okay, so there is one little issue to um, that you have to deal with in Friesen's Connect Me Design It, and that is it does not allow you to uh, put in PNG files. There is a workaround. I'm going to show it to you. So the two types of files that you can put in are JPEGs or TIFF files, okay? And I'm going to show you how to change it in Photoshop. So here I have a PNG file. It's the Project 2020 logo in this case. And you can see it's got this checkerboard pattern. And all that tells you is that this is um, a transparent background. Now when you save this as a JPEG, when you see your JPEG, it's going to look like that. It's going to go black because a JPEG does not allow for any transparency in the background. Okay, so that's what it'll look like. So here's the trick. You go File, Save As, and you change it from the format to a TIFF file. When you change it to a format, so it's called Revised Magnet No Border, and I'm remembering where I'm saving it, and I'm going to say Save. Um, this option here... Um, if you're keeping it on your computer, you might want to save it as layers, but we're going to get rid of that step anyway, so we'll, it doesn't really matter. You can just say as a copy. That's easier. Okay, so we say save, and then it's going... I, I had already done it, so it did that. Now, I just want to show you here. You have to say save transparency here, and that's what gives you the transparent background. All these options, you can just leave the way they are and hit OK, and now... If you had a PNG file that you found and you want to use that, it's now saved as a PNG file. So if I go back to here, um, I'm going to upload an image. So under Library, here's Images. I'm going to add a category, and we're going to call this an image, and the category type is, I'm going to call this Logos. I hit Create Category. Now I'm going to Upload, and you can do more than one at a time, but I'm going to say I want it to go into the Logos library and I'm going to browse to my desktop here here's my desktop and let's see I'll put it today there it is there and I hit open and now that's the name of the file and I'm going to say start upload now it's a large file see it's seven megabytes but that's fine because it's all on the net anyway and then once that's done and there it is so now when I place that into my page it will paste with a transparent background and that's how you change it from PNG to TIFF. It's a small step you have to do, but um, if you don't want to have the outline around the image, that's what you need to do. Okay, actually on a Mac, it's even easier, and there might be a Windows application. You guys, if you find one, put it in the Edsby comments. But on a Mac, if you open up your PNG in Preview, the app called Preview, okay? Now I just go File, Export, change the for file format to TIFF, Okay, and see this little option here for an alpha channel? That's what you need. So transparency is also called an alpha channel. That's more of a video term. And you hit save. And you've done the same thing. Now you can upload that TIFF to it, to Freezons.